Hey, what's up, you guys? Welcome back to the channel. Thank you for joining me, as always. You're joining me here with my 2017 BMW 440i. And I got a bit of an interesting one for you guys today, because if you look around, we're not in the usual setting that you find myself in. And that's because I am up in Deep Creek, Maryland for Thanksgiving, actually, spending time out here with family. And my sister actually has a place, has a nice townhouse right on the ski slope which is insane. So I actually brought my car three and a half hours from where I live up here to Deep Creek. And it's a really, really beautiful place, guys. So I thought this would be an awesome opportunity to take y'all on a little POV drive, show you around Deep Creek, show you some of my favorite roads to drive. But first, before we get into our regularly scheduled program, I wanna take a walk over here with you guys. I just wanna give you guys a little bit of a preview of what we have in store for today's drive. We're gonna take a short little hike over here through the woods. And after a super quick little hike, we pop out right in the middle of a ski run, you guys. Look at this. We're right on the middle of a black diamond ski slope. So if any of you guys are skiers out there, you can appreciate this. This is Wisp Resort, Maryland in uh, Deep Creek. And you see out here is a big old lake. So during the winter, this is more of a ski town. And during the summer, it's a big old lake town. You got all the boats out on the lake. And there's roads that drive all around the perimeter of the lake and all up there through the woods. So this is gonna be epic, you guys. I'm super excited to take you along with me. Let's get to it. Let's hop in the car and drive around. It's freaking cold out here. It's like 32 degrees, feels like 28. And I'm just wearing a hoodie, which is really dumb. So I wanna hurry up and get in the warmth of my car. Yeah, so this is one of the first places I really wanted to take you guys. It's the top of the ski resort where the chairlifts let you off. If we're lucky, I can get over here. Check this out. This is so stupid. I can't believe I'm doing this. <laughs> I, I don't see any no trespassing signs. <laughs> This is crazy. This is like straight up what's covered in snow in the winter that people are skiing down. These are all ski runs. And I am off-roading. Okay, I don't know if I'm supposed to be up here, but I want to get a thumbnail really bad. So I'm gonna park my car and hop out real quick and attempt to get a thumbnail. Look at this guys, there's like a big old bobcat up here. Definitely not a place meant for a lowered BMW, but hey, anything for a thumbnail, right? Oh yeah, that's it right there. <laughs> I can't believe I'm up here right now. You can hear that one over there hissing because it's about to make snow. They were up here all night last night, blasting fake snow. Guys, look at how crazy this is. I cannot believe this car is up here right now. I don't even know if I'm supposed to be out here, but you know, look at the chairlifts. Man, that is crazy. I really wanna get my car out here and take pics, but I am not gonna do that. Wow, it looks good. Holy crap, I think I'm gonna need to take another thumbnail. <laughs> All right. We'll get out of here and uh, go on an actual drive, guys. This car is so much fun. If anyone out there is watching this video because they're interested in picking up a 440i, 
Freaking do it. What are you waiting for? Sell a kidney if you have to. <laughs> Alright, it's a little cold outside. I'm gonna put the window up and just hope it sounds good for you guys. Let's see. How do we sound? Listen to this intake. <laughs> I think it sounds a little better in third. <laughs> That's the BMS intake. It's like a $200 intake and it makes your car sound freaking awesome. This car hugs turns so well. It's insane. I can only imagine it's because of the KW V3s. Oh my god. It's so fast. Oh. Listen to that. <laughs> so good. All right, guys, I'm gonna head down the mountain now and show you around the lake a little bit. You can kind of see it out there in the distance. Look at how steep this is, it's insane. I don't think the camera does it justice. But anyway, there's a bunch more cool roads to go to that I really want to get to before the sun goes down. Oh, and by the way, anyone who might be wondering why my check engine light is on, it's because of my catted high flow downpipe. It's a big reason why I want to switch away from JB4 and get either MHD or boot mod. So if anyone has opinions about that, please leave a comment down below because pretty soon here, I'm probably going to switch, I think to boot mod. BM3, whatever people call it. This is the town of Accident, Maryland. <laughs> and what you see is what you get. You can drive through, clear through from one end of town to the other in like two minutes. And there's one gas station and you know, one liquor store, one car wash, but they do have a self-service car wash. So, you know, maybe it's not so bad of a place to live. Look, here's the uh, Chrysler Dodge Jeep Ram dealership. You got your car dealership, and that's it. That might be the primary business in this entire town. Mark it on the maps, you guys, because this is a uh, vacation destination, I tell you what. It's actually a pretty cool piece of Maryland history, all kidding aside. Oh yeah, I think we made it. We just appreciate how nice this scenery is. I love driving through the woods like this. This is like big woods too. Woo! Big old mountains to the left and to the right. Wow, this is cool. All right, let's see what she's got. All right, slow it down, slow it down.
what? Look at this. What is this? Got the 76er sign. What? Wow. <laughs> that guy had some really cool stuff. It was like an old makeshift gas station. It had that big old 76 logo. That's a gas station, right? Pretty sure it is. Man, look at this. I'm really tempted to pull over and just check out this creek over here for a second. Let's go have a little field trip, shall we? Yo, check this out. There's steps. What? I picked an awesome spot to park. Ugh. It's really slippery, and I am in uh, chucks. Wow. Whoop. What is this? U.S. Geological Survey. That's cool. Look at that. Wow. So cool. I had to at least park and get out and take a look at it. It looked too too tantalizing from the road. <laughs> look at this big old rock. Alright. I just wanted to take a quick check on the river. Because why not? Look at that sexy thing. Dang. I mean, for not being an M4, it looks a hell of a lot like one. And I'm telling you, for anyone who has one of these cars, 437M wheels with KW coilovers is an insane combination. she's tame I wanted to say that I'm sorry to you guys that you know it's been like three weeks since I've uploaded a video and I'm pretty you know spotty with my upload schedule and uh, that's honestly because I am a full-time software developer and uh, my life has been crazy recently <laughs> um, in September I left uh, my current job um, and I expected to get a new job within like a month and uh, You know life loves to right when you think you have a plan life loves to prove you wrong and tell you that you know nothing <laughs> and uh, So that fell through and I ended up spending like two months without a job and uh, it was really stressful because you know I live on my own in a townhouse I pay my own bills and all that and uh you know, I had to sell a bunch of stuff and, and, you know, it was just, just times were tight. Um, and you know, other, you know, really bad things happened. you know, in September, my dog died, unfortunately. And, uh, I haven't mentioned anything to you guys about that because it, it hit me pretty hard. Um, but my point is life has been pretty tough and, uh, you know, it's not, super easy for me to get out and find the motivation to uh, film a YouTube video for you guys but um, no I really care about the channel and I really care about my subscribers and uh, I appreciate every comment that you guys make and I read all the comments and uh, you know I really appreciate it when you guys reach out to me and you tell me that you know you found my channel and you love the videos and you've been learning a lot um, you know that kind of thing makes my day so you know, that I really wanted to get out here and at least, you know, film a video and show you guys around, you know? Look at these big houses that are right on the water. I'm actually going to slow it down here because I want you guys to see this. Look at this. Like, look at how beautiful that is. Look at that.
Oh my God. It's so pretty out here, even in the winter. And these people just, you walk out of your house and you have that right there. Wow. Look at this out here. Wow. Definitely gonna have to get some pics right there, I think. Before the sun goes down, I'm gonna do it real quick. That's top priority, you guys. Wow. Look at this. That is sick. It is freezing cold, but I don't even care. All right, sorry about that, guys. Can't miss an opportunity like that when you, pro when you cross a bridge and you see the water and the sun like that. Just gotta stop traffic real quick, no big deal. Oh, man. I'm like losing it over here. It's so pretty out here when the sun sets. <laughs> Whew. I know you can hear the intake that time. You gotta watch out for black bears around here too. Black bears everywhere. This is the kind of place where you gotta lock up your trash because if you don't, the bears will get into it. Man, this is so pretty out here right now though. Look at that. So yeah, what do you guys think of the 440? I haven't done anything to the interior except for uh, just like vinyl stickers on the logo. Um, what do you guys think? Should I should I put like carbon fiber on this, or get like those uh, super clicky paddles? I haven't really been interested in uh, modifying the interior. I think the interior of the F32 is really nice. Especially like an M Sport interior. And you got the nice steering wheel with the with the M badge on it and all the goodies. Harman Kardon sound system is really nice. <laughs> Wish it was summertime so I could roll the windows completely down. The one thing you guys can't hear is the uh, turbo whistle out the back. Sounds so good. Like when you're in a garage, you can just hear it whistling the whole time. Super cool. back over the bridge so cool this is like my favorite time of night you guys this is when I get out and I just go for a drive like every single night I really need to start bringing you all along with me more often I struggle with these POV videos to be honest with you because uh, the feedback that I've gotten from people is that I need to talk more uh, whether it's about the car or just random things in general um, apparently people like it better when I talk because I was under the impression that y'all wanted me to just shut up and drive and you were watching the video because you want to like you know hear the 440 and just you know watch the video for the car not just like me talking the whole time but who knows? 
I'm proving time and time again that I know nothing. Woo! God! It's so freaking brutal. Now my car isn't as aggressive as uh, Sticks. A lot of people, a lot of you that watch my channel also watch his channel. And uh, I'm pretty sure he's like full straight pipe. I can't remember, but his exhaust is way louder than mine. Uh, but, you know, mine's still plenty loud in my opinion. And I never even touched the exhaust on the 335 except for unplugging that uh, solenoid that opens the valve. Uh, but so the car was pretty quiet. This car is like twice as loud as that car ever was. All right, gotta slow down through here. Click it or tick it. That's never gonna get old. This car pulls so hard. The freaking B58 is such an awesome motor. Well guys, we're back where we started. Standing in the middle of a black diamond run. I believe this run is called Main Street at Wisp. I'll be here in February skiing it super cool sun's going down it's really cold out here but this is just a really beautiful place that i like to come because it's quiet out here and you can't beat the view i mean freaking look at that with the moon and the lake it's not too hard to see why i love coming here so anyway guys i'm gonna wrap up the video here if you're still watching to this point, I really appreciate it. And uh, you know, as always, please give the video a like and uh, subscribe if you haven't already. I'd really appreciate it. But I'm out here shivering, so I'm gonna wrap it up and get inside. Hope you all had a happy Thanksgiving and uh, I'll catch you on the next one. Peace. Why you gotta look so fine?